There has been a huge decline in mental health around the world, which is why we are so committed to creating more content than we ever have. Thanks for being part of our journey. Do you ever notice your classmate or coworker who does not seem to talk much, but when they do, they always have something interesting to contribute? Or maybe you're the type to be more silent, but have tons of thoughts constantly running through your head. One thing is for certain, if you think Netflix has too many shows, try looking inside an introvert's brain. There is always a steady stream of thoughts running through their minds. Introverts are introspective in their thinking and focus on internal thoughts, feelings, and moods. Are you curious what these thoughts may be? Here are a list of five things introverts think, but never say. Number one, I don't always wanna hang out, but I still wanna be invited. Have you ever felt so drained once you reached the weekend that you decided to spend your solitary time at home to recharge? It's been a hectic week and all you wanna do is retreat into a shell and read that new book you just bought the other day. However, you heard that your friends had made plans. You may not wanna go, but you still wanna be invited. For introverts, time alone is essential. The conflict in their lives is between wanting to be invited to things, but not wanting to go. Number two, would they think I'm boring and uninteresting? Do you ever think that you are uninteresting to others? Perhaps you're fond of enjoying your own time, sipping tea in an isolated place while creating imaginary worlds in your mind. Introverts are usually quiet around people they don't know very well. They might be afraid of what the person might think of them or what they say. Combine this with their dislike for small talk, some people may view introverts as uninteresting. However, when introverts find an interesting topic to talk about, they can ramble on for hours. Number three, is it okay if I'm not saying too much? Have you ever been in a conversation and worried about how the other person perceives you? Perhaps you're on a date and you're more comfortable being the one to ask a few questions and listen to your date talking. And then it occurs to you, is it okay if I'm not saying too much? You know you're entirely invested in the person in front of you, but you're not sure if they're aware of that. People with introverted personalities often observe things while thinking in their heads constantly. Apart from that, introverts thrive in silence. Number four, is it obvious that I sometimes ignore my calls and messages? Do you become anxious when your phone is ringing? Calls demand immediate attention and distract you from the task at hand. Even if someone they like calls, introverts may not answer. Introverts might also greatly appreciate if the person who wants to call them schedules the call over text. This way they can look forward to talking with the person and avoid the dread that always comes with the surprise of a phone ringing. Number five, I hope they cancel our plans so that I don't have to go. Have you ever received an invitation from your friend to hang out, but you secretly wish for them to cancel the plans? When plans are canceled, you feel free. Sometimes introverts tend to say yes to every plan and go out of their way to see people even if these activities leave them feeling depleted. So when their friends cancel plans, they feel relieved because they don't wanna make their friends feel bad when they cancel the plans themselves. There are various types of introverts and not all of them are the same. Everyone has unique personality traits and no one fits into a single category or box. But hopefully this video gives you a better understanding of how people with introverted personality types think, act, and feel. Till next time, Psych2Goers.